How do you feel during your first big DIY home project? Don't want to talk about it right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so tell us what this is. So this is the whole house or whole home filtration system. So we're going to be showering and drinking filter water, basically. <laughs> yeah. Washing dishes, washing food and everything, clothes, whatever. So we went with Springwell. We did our research and we think this is a good one. We'll find out. <laughs> 820. And that includes a... Two extra filters. Which is another year replacement. Maybe just this came and maybe the other stuff's coming tomorrow. I'll see you on chat. Hey guys. Didn't have any of the other no stuff. Oh, nothing. So I'm looking at these like, I don't see anything. Uh, okay, so, well. Part of the shipment's here. Part of the shipment's here. Alrighty. So, finally putting this thing together. Peter had to go out and get a hose. So that way we can fill that thing up with water. It has to sit with water for two days. And then this week we're having a friend coming and helping us install that and our water softener. Oh my goodness, it's black water coming out. What? Peter's going to turn it off right now. And then it ran clear. But the water was black at first. That's why it's supposed to soak and then flush it. Oh. It's carbon. Oh, okay. All right, time to hook this up and have filtered water with this. It's coming. Get ready. It's been two minutes. <laughs> Maybe. It's like sounds like a trickle now. Are you sure it's open? Yeah, I can open it more though. No, 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 no not that. Like these. Those are open. Oh! Oh! No. It's clear. How did that happen? I don't know. Yeah. Magic. Wow. I thought that was gonna be like all black, but I guess the system, <laughs> wow. I don't know, whatever magic it had. So how do we know when it's like flushed through and not just this one coming in? I'm gonna let it go for it. We'll do a few buckets. Okay. And third bucket. Lisa, move it. What are you doing? Ow. I'm filming. Oops. My bad. And now we switch it and do the same. bucket of um, water we've had to jump because it's been leaking while Peter had to make was it only two trips to Lowe's? Of course, yeah, three this morning. Yeah. <laughs> and cutter thing. Okay, you ready? You're gonna need to grab yep. that. Go. Yep. Ah, oh, man. And Apparently the water shut off valve doesn't totally work. Yeah, right? you become a plumber. Yeah, right? <laughs> Oh, oh. Just push that back. Got it? Yep. I think let's go in the bucket. Now. Oh! <gasps> it stopped! No. Oh. <laughs> Not quite. Yeah. Not the prettiest thing, but hey. We'll yeah, this, this thing is a crazy concoction. Why is it coming out the back again? Because it's not tight yet. It'll be fine once it's tight. Okay. Theoretically. No <gasps> more leaking! It stopped! Yay, honey! <coughs> Yay! Oh, okay. <gasps> does that mean you actually can turn our water back on? Not yet. Not what? Yet. Program this, put oh. some salts in it, and then we can turn it all on. Yes, Not I need to take a shower. I was gonna take one last night after our water was, you know, fresh, but didn't. And so now I'm gonna take one this morning, and it's still not working. But we had water overnight. Um, we just didn't have a filter. And I wanna take a filtered shower. All right, so we're kind of having like a, if you give a mouse a cookie type scenario. 
just fixed the water softener, water filtration. There are finally no leaks after eight runs to lows in 20 hours last night and then all day today. Um, and we had this water like running the whole time while we were in the garage. So just to test to make sure the water was going and then sometimes we, Peter left it on like last night for a long time and this morning I left it on for a long time. And now it's not working. So apparently so 24 years of bad pipes and we just kept the water of the bad pipes running through this and now it's just, yeah, it's, it's done. So it's like, hey, we, we fixed that, great, now I have to fix this. And we're just kind of like, done. <laughs> hire a Like, hire, yeah, so we were I trying, I mean, we had a really good friend that came and helped us and he was so knowledgeable, that was awesome. Um, but we are not knowledgeable and anyways, so now it's just, it's screwed up and so, um, and a whole day wasted of work, um, uh, because we both have kind of been on this today and... Because we thought it was going to be easy, finish, there's like three things to screw <laughs> on this morning, but then there were leaks and so I went to the store to get new connections, so we didn't have any leaks, we got those. So the reason for so many runs to the store was because we were returning things that were like, this isn't the right thing, we need this instead. What well, did the lady changing parts. And what did the lady to. say to you this morning? Oh uh, yeah, see you in two minutes. <laughs> when he returned something. <sighs> they got snow as well down there. Oh goodness. I, yeah, I don't know if this is my future or not. I just have to What, homeownership or just doing no, like DIY? Like, yeah, DIYing it, like figuring out, I mean, I kind of want to, I want to learn and see, like, the yeah. headache is at the beginning. Like, I remember when I started web design, like, I was so frustrated at times, like, doing some basic stuff that now I can troubleshoot right away, but right. I know what I'm doing. And, like, that's how it is when you're learning anything new. It's just frustrating and time-consuming, and you make so many mistakes that you don't know what you're doing, <laughs> and so then you're trying to figure out what in the world is going on, right. why things are not going right, and, uh, anyway, and then you set off a chain reaction, potentially, like this, and it creates more headaches, and when you're... When, if you have the time, it's fine, but if you don't have the time, then it's stressful because then you're getting further behind on other projects, so, eh. Okay, so third day in a row that we are working on this water filtration water softener system. So Peter, tell us what's happening. So there are two connections, this connection onto this pipe, and this connection onto this pipe where it's leaking just a tad. There's just a very slow little drip drip leak that's just coming out, it'll drop a little at a time. Um, so it creates a little bit of a puddle, a little bit of moisture on the floor here. Not good, we need to be able to put insulation on this so these pipes don't freeze, the water doesn't freeze inside. And so I think the problem is I had cut these pipes and I tried to smooth them out but there might be a little bit of a burr on the edge so I gotta somehow smooth this off so a little bit better so that it makes a tighter seal on the inside, it's a little bit finicky. Uh, if that doesn't work for some reason, what we'll do is we'll pull this off and we're going to go to the store and get a $25 tool to cut the plastic better. But hopefully I can get this smooth so it'll work. We'll see. Alright, and how much have all of these um, twisty pipes cost so far? So each one of these is $20. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six. So Six times, yeah, that's not too bad. That's 120. $120. Okay. Plus about $9 per one of these other connections. So one, two, three. So 150. So you're looking at 150 versus to have a professional plumber come and set all this up. You're looking at $400. Plus you need to be on a plan, otherwise it's 520. And um, we know this because we had someone just come out. <laughs> we had somebody just come out uh, from a local plumbing company who's very professional, very good. Uh, we decided to try to see if we can do, fix this one more time. If we can't, then we'll have him do it. But it's so close. If we can get it to where it's not leaking when we move stuff around, we'll be good. Because we've already we, spent so now, much time now, on it. Yeah, we spent, and now <laughs> we just did the calculations again, too. It's like, okay, yeah, 150 bucks is a whole lot better than 400, see? 500. So. I think we're so close. We're so, so close, so we'll, yeah. yeah, we just talked ourselves into trying this again and going to the store and getting a cutter, $25 cutter if we need to, <laughs> rather than spending 400 Yeah.
say I should take that sticker off. Watch it. Yo. Haha. That just saved you $250, honey. Good job. All right, now it should work. Reenact. Finally got Wait, no, it. No, 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 reenact. Mm, I'm not pulling off. <laughs> okay, it finally went the last like half of an inch. So. Now we should have no more good. leaks. All right, we're about to find out. Good job, I'm proud of you. All right, let's see what happens. Okay. Okay, let's see. Oh, no, still dripping. Ah, what's wrong with this is. one? This one's not. All right, so we solved this one. I think. Yeah. So it means it's possible to fix. There you go. <laughs> if we can get, if we can keep improving one by one, then we're getting closer. So at first, before we had this dripping, this dripping, <laughs> this dripping, <laughs> and this dripping, and then this dripping. This is not dripping. This is not dripping. This is not dripping. And now this is not dripping. So I. There you go, honey. <laughs> All right, I'll go um, drain the water in the house. Just gonna drain the water that's in the pipe so that way we don't get sprayed with all of that water like we did two times already. Okay, so twice we have pulled this pipe out of the wall and water comes gushing, gushing out. And we have our water turned off, but our like main valve here isn't working and so we'd have to go like outside to turn it off which I guess we could do that so it doesn't bust. Another thing the guy looked at is our water heater which is original to the house so it's 24 years old. Water heaters are supposed to last 8 to 10 years. This one has long lived its life expectancy. Um, he said it could go out at any time um, and for them to like install one it's $2,000. But it does look like Lowe's sells like a maybe a lower end one for 500 and that they might then do installation for an additional cost. So that would probably be a whole lot better. Um, although like we did really like the company that came out, so they were great. Um, but it's just expensive. <laughs> oh, and the sink is back on. I remember we showed you that the sink wasn't working in the guest bathroom here. It's working. We were trying to show the guy that came out today. We we're like, yeah, it's not working. We turned it on. It's working. So. That's great. He said, I have no idea why that would have shut off, but it did, and now it's working, so. Woo! So this, if you can see, the edge is a little bit damaged. I don't think that part matters. It's more this end that matters. This one fell out of one of those, apparently, at one point. Um, I'm not sure where, but wherever it fell out of is not leaking. So we're gonna go ahead and just put this in place of this one, because this one is leaking right now and see if that helps. Yeah, it's I do. It's not like it. All right, so my mom just tried to call and we ignored her and then I sent her a picture of what we're currently doing and she texts back, you're still working on that? <laughs> yes, yes we are. All right, so before we replace the entire thing, Peter's just gonna cut a little bit more off of it and hope to get a cleaner cut. Oh, it definitely looks cleaner than the last one. All right, this should do it. Please. Nope. Oh, no. See? Oh. That's really bad. That's even worse. Oh, that just makes me mad. Why? Why? Okay, trying a plastic one. So, I'm not super confident, but we can try it. Pretty good, we got one leak eliminated, we got one left, so I'm trying to reconnect one more time. Okay. It's been, hang on, 12, 13, this is 13 hours into it so far. Oh, man. <laughs> yes, okay. nine trips to Lowe's. That's, that's plumbing, unless you really, really have done a lot of plumbing, that's, that's just the name of the game. Lots yeah. Of, lots of figuring out and lots of reassessing. Yep. 
This has been an expensive system. Um, probably fifteen hundred dollars for everything total. Isn't that what you said? Eight, four, twelve, thirteen fifty. Thirteen fifty. Okay. So it wasn't too far out for fifteen hundred, but it should last ten years. So. Cool. Yeah. Is this gonna be it? No, what? That's even worse. worse. Well, it's coming from the top. I didn't think I got all the way in and I didn't. So. Okay, that's the top, not the bottom now. Right. All right, let's yeah, try again. All... Now it should go. I think that's all the way in. So now, hopefully we're in business. yippee ki -yay. Nothing's coming out. <gasps> Sweat here. Okay, so that last- it's finally good. That Ooh, last issue, that last issue was because pushing up and then Broke apparently that. broke it and so yeah it wasn't sealing correctly so quick tip because this is a really tight fit so what i ended up doing is i used that spare one i had and i put it inside the pipe first because that just perfectly fits in there so that way i didn't jam it in and mess it up and then i just pushed it up into the fitting there you go that's the way to do it actually yeah so you don't break it yeah it's, it's done Whew. Mr. Hoppy, how do you feel during your first big DIY home project? Don't want to talk about it right now. <laughs> <laughs> I want some paper towels. We got to clean this off. All right. So we got, I put a valve, shut off valve in here that comes out and then it goes into this pre-filter, sediment filter. And then it comes down another shut off valve. So when I got to change that filter, I can shut off both ends. And it goes into the water filter. So this is the whole house water filtration system. So basically now we're gonna have filtered water going through the entire house. So you shower in it, drink it, whatever, straight out of the faucet, it's like bottled water. <laughs> I just wanted to cry last night. <laughs> <laughs> he no. woke up at 2 a.m. and came out here to find that there were some slow leaks. Well, I wanted to make sure it wasn't flooding or something. And so. then he came back in and he was like, yeah, it looked like he was about in tears. She's like, there's water out there. <laughs> now I'm gonna be a pro. Figure out how to put that plastic thing out before you insert it, it's way easier. Only the last time. <laughs> Waited to learn that in the last connection. And now I can insulate this puppy. Yeah! Got you some scissors. Still, I need some real, I need a knife. You said you scissors. I was said knife and then you said scissors. <laughs> Should I show you your plumber crack? Nope, don't do it. <laughs> I mean, this just looks so good, honey. It doesn't really look good in my opinion, but. It looks good because you did it. <laughs> oh, she so has cute. her bow on, so <laughs> cute. Oh, she's waving, see? Oh, you yeah. are waving. Hey. Hi, sweetie. Just it up just for you. <laughs> Aww. And all for thirteen fifty. All this can be yours. <laughs> and three nights of work. Well, see the thing is, if I do this again, I can do this a whole lot faster now. Figure it's out true. how to do all this little stuff. I know. Yeah.